Hey everybody, how's it going? It's going pretty good, right? Right? Okay, we just jumped back into Don't Starve. And uh, I'm starving to death, which is actually not alright at all. I actually forgot what the hell happened last time, what we did. <laughs> um, We are starving to death. I do remember we laid down some traps last time. Oh, look at this, a crab. A crab, just for the taking. Um, I read some tips. And apparently we can, with a shovel, dig up the magma. Magma! Dig up the magma pile. And actually, oh wait. I didn't even have to kill that thing inside my inventory. I didn't even kill the crab inside my inventory. Oh, I just ate the... Oh. I ate the seeds raw. Okay, that was really bad. Um, we did build a science machine. So, speaking of a shovel and all of that goody good stuff. We are going to build a shovel. We have the... We have the materials to make it but we have to ask ourselves shall we finally let's dig up this sandy pile all right let's dig it up some more all right let's go ahead and pick this sand up can I dig it up what there's no buried treasure at all what happened to the buried treasure oh shit I hit E okay oh we caught a crab <laughs> This is, I'm so sorry, it's always so chaotic when you come back into these things. It really is for me. Jeez. Okay, let's murder. 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 We're gonna murder some crabs and we're gonna eat them up. We're actually A-OK -okay on food, I think, for right now. We don't necessarily need to go out. What the hell? Dig. Oh, oh, look at that. It's gold. Golden rocks. Whoa, shit. Get the stuff, quick. Oh, it's a volcano. Oh, we're hot. Oh, fire! Bum, no, no, bum, no, no, no. Get out of here, Toucan Sam. Toucan Christ. Holy shit. Is that just going to... Oh, no. It went away. It's like Satan's asshole opening up. <laughs> Spewing out golden rocks everywhere. I'm terribly sorry. That probably put an image inside of your head that you did not want there. But it's... It's too late. It's too late, I must say. The image is there, burned inside of your memory. Okay, so I thought we were actually going to get some buried treasure out of the sandy piles, but it appears that we do not get any, which is very unfortunate. Um, so, like I was saying before, some tips taught me that. You can actually, I figured you can dig the sandy piles, but I did not know you could dig the magma um, little piles that we have there. Uh, first things first is we should probably try and see if we can make a crock pot at some point in time. I do remember it's charcoal and stuff like that. Um, it's been a while since I've made one. Palm leaf hut? Ooh. Escape the rain, mostly. It is a very tropical area, and tropical areas usually have a lot of rain. Rainfall happening. Okay, we need charcoal and cut stone. Let's see if we can refine some cut stone. I believe we should be able to. We should be able to make at least three. This is going to be our main base kind of area. Ooh. I really do want, like, a palm leaf kind of structure where I can just lay my head and, you know, have a good time. We have 3% on the old captain hat. Okay, it's a bit insane in the membrane. Uh, let's go back to food. A crock pot will definitely help us with meals and such. So, we do have three cut stone. That's done. We could do with more twigs and some more charcoal. Alright, we just have to burn down some trees. I think that's a day nine kind of thing. It's a day nine objective. We'll go cut down... Um, and burn down trees. We'll do both of that. We'll cut down and burn down trees and get some charcoal for a crock pot. That way we can start making some really good meals for our character here. Old strongman Bruno. Which I do realize that's not his actual name in the game, but I like to think of him as strongman Bruno. You know that wrestler? You know, the wrestler dude? It's, um, you can look it up. You can see pictures of him online. Just like, the dude looks like strongman Bruno. He's just like really strong. Oh, look at this. More crabs. Perfect. I love crabs. Whoa! The lava ignited again! Examine Cressure. Okay. Maybe I should stand back. 
Maybe. Jeez, it could be like our night light. Oh, there's twigs here. Okay, let's go ahead and put our good old trusty shovel away. But look at this, twigs. We need these. Twigs are very useful, actually. And we can get some more gold from this island, which is fantastic. Also, there's plenty of rocks, which is going to be very, very good for us because we will need plenty of rocks. Oh boy, it's getting really dark. It's getting really dark out here. <laughs> it looks like the night is getting very, very short. So I'm not exactly sure how the seasons work in the, the tropical area here. I'm pretty sure it's not going to snow at some point. That'd be crazy. That'd be insane. I figured we are probably somewhere in the equator. If anything, we have to look out for it being extremely, extremely hot and the rain falling down on my face. We can do with getting rid of these sandy piles. Can we actually get rid of them? Rid of them? I mean, or are we stuck here with them? Who knows? Uh, we started our own palm tree farm here. Uh, or what? We don't have any logs, do we? We can't start a fire. A proper fire. Look. We're going to put at least, like, I don't know, six of these grass onto the fire pit. And we're going to cook up some stuff. It's going to be fantastic. In day nine, we can go out, uh, maybe go to a different island and look for a bunch of resources. We're going to fill up on some food, which is going to be nice. Um, a fish more so, which we can cook. Mmm. Oh shit, look at this. Let's go look at this. Ah, it's beautiful, isn't it? That's really awesome. So, I guess once you dig up all of the magma piles, it actually lights up the whole, whole place. Which is going to be good. Apparently we can do some stuff with sand. I'm not exactly sure what we can do with it. But we're going to put it in here, in our chest. And we're going to put these doubloons in here as well. There's a bunch of stuff we can do with all of this inside here but I think for the most part we should be fine we'll put a lock suit on uh, we probably leave the bat uh, no let's bring the backpack I mean a life jacket I'm not sure what it does but we're going to keep a hand on it anyways daytime's coming okay it's looking good how are we hunger wise we can get some food on the way I think we'll be able to actually yeah come here you son of a bitch <laughs> I just tried attacking toucan salmon did not go so great Okay, so our traps seem to be in an okay position. It seems like the tide just comes in just enough. Okay, I'm starting to get wet here. Okay. We're going to get into the log raft here. Can I... Can I get into it? Okay. I was uh, right-clicking it instead of left-clicking it. Um, seaweed, I've been told numerous times, is a great, great resource, you know, for food and all that kind of stuff. Do we need to put the machete away? I don't think we want to actually... Uh, machete the seaweed. Can we mine coral reef? Oh shit, there's a fish. There's a big old dogfish. Okay. Let's take a look actually real quick. Where have we been? Okay, we started out over here, which is pretty nice. And then we came through here. Tons of seaweed. And there's that extra raft in case we need it. There's tons of stuff here. We could go back to this island, but I do want to go up north some. Because I think that'd be pretty great. You know, we need to explore. We need to go somewhere we have not been yet. And I can eat the seaweed as we go, which is pretty nice. We're going to try and avoid these jellyfish. What a, yeah, jellyfish. Get out of here, you sons of bitches. And maybe the dogfish as well, I'm not sure. Maybe we can get a leash and put a collar on him. Who knows? You might be able to. Just maybe. Okay, the game was saving there, so it like totally froze up for a second. <laughs> That's like classic don't starve, am I right? Um, pick grass. Oh, it's like a different... Oceany biome over here. Okay, we're gonna have to start eating seaweed raw here soon. The hell was that? <laughs> I heard some like, like something fell out in the other room. I think my dogs just tried to, like, savage something. I might have to go check on that, cause it's like a box of chocolates out on the uh, dinner table. So I think my dogs might be getting the chocolate right now. I should go check on that, right? Cause chocolate's really bad for dogs. <laughs> Okay, sorry about that. <laughs> I really had to go and check and make sure my dogs were not just utterly tearing through a box of chocolate, which would have been really bad. Um, I'm, take I'm taking a look at our hunger here, and it's not very well. Okay. Ooh. We had to eat some raw seaweed, and raw seaweed is not good. What am I doing collecting grass? We don't need grass. We need to get on an island, and we need to get there quick, because we need some food. Okay? What is this? Oh, here we go. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, a parrot. Mmm. Parrot's on the menu, boys. Okay, this is where we're going to get off at. 
We need to start chopping down some stuff pretty quickly here. First, I need to look for some berries or something. Oh, I don't think this island has any berries. It has trees, though, which we can burn down. Oh, no. <laughs> we need to find some food. Oh, no. Okay, we're going to get on our raft here. We were going to stop there, but there's nothing there for us. We'll get some more seaweed, which is really nice. And we'll keep going north. How about that? We can always come back down to where our main base is, which is really nice. Uh, it's a shame we couldn't catch some dogfish or something. Oh, oh, look at this. Seaweed everywhere. Don't mind if I do. We take a bit of a hit on the old sanity, but I think we'll be fine. Yeah. We're fine, pretty much, right? Ooh, sanity's pretty bad. We're at 41 hunger, though, which is nice. If we get all this stuff cooked, we'll be good for a while. We may want to start heading back here soon, though. It doesn't seem like there's much up north. It's good, though. It's good to do this and Don't Starve, is to explore and know where all the resources are. Like, look at this. There's tons of coral reef up here, which I'm sure is fantastic for something. Right? Something's got to be good with coral reef. We might need something. Maybe we can get, like, a, a coral reef hat. Come here, you dogfish. I'm going to get you. Come here, you son of a bitch. Okay, we're going to get some more seaweed. And I think we'll be able to last hunger-wise until we get all the way back to our main base, which is down south. How far are we? Well, we went a pretty far away, which is pretty nice. Um, tomorrow we can go. What's that? What is that there? Is that dogfish? Is that what they look like on the map? Must be so. It looks like some kind of lobster. Can we get lobster? Hmm. You know what? That'd be really good if you can get some lobster. Really would be. Okay. Oh, the one thing I don't have is like a mini map mod which would be really nice you should be able to write down a, a map on it oh shit you hear that barking <laughs> let me go check that out okay i'm back once again i had to leave for some crazy crazy reason <laughs> i think someone was at my door my dog was barking you could probably hear it on the audio probably pretty well it's crazy when you have like dogs they just love to bark at everything i'm sure you've heard of my past recordings the dogs Barking at anything and everything, which is great. Ooh, more seaweed for me. That's what I'm talking about. There we go. Okay, so like I was saying, it'd be nice to have a mini map or something, or you can be able to write uh, some stuff down on your mini map and then end up, you know, be able to take a look at it. I guess that's kind of what we're doing right now, but I did see a mod um, on the Steam Workshop earlier today where it just kind of unlocks the whole map automatically. Whoa. What the hell? Whoa. Is our ship falling apart on us? I think it is. Okay, that's not good. How far away are we? We're not very far. Okay. We can go ahead and set um, sail full steam ahead back towards home. Because we're not too far away. We'll be able to get there in time, which is pretty nice. We'll cook up some seaweed. And we'll get ready for daytime. I think we'll be A-OK -okay for day 10. Is this? Is this home? Oh, it is. Okay. We'll just get off right here because it doesn't really matter. Where we leave our raft. It won't go away. You should have to tie it up somewhere, I think. Would be good. Hopefully our trees have grown. Oh, there's some seaweed there we can have. There's some seaweed there to be had. If only... We could burn down these trees, but I don't really want to. Okay. We do need some wood, though, so we're going to cut down a tree. We're going to cut down this guy. Right? Unless we can actually find a tree over here, maybe? Oh! Crabs! Hell yeah! Look at this! Oh, let's murder these guys. How are we on hunger? Ten? Okay. We're gonna be- a oh shit. The flames just went up sky high. Oh, this is amazing. Okay, we can probably shovel up some of this um, stumps that are in the ground. The flame is shooting way sky high. We can uh, just have enough time to cook up our food um, before day ten actually starts. This is fun. This is so much stuff to do. It's really cool. I mean, I love surviving on an island. Like, I, I want to do, actually do that. <laughs> you know how much fun that would be? I feel like I could do that. At least. Okay, do we have any planks? No, we don't have enough for a plank. We're just going to put raw lug. Uh, raw lug. <laughs> we're going to put a raw lug on the fire. We're going to do three, because fuck it, right? Okay, we're going to eat these things. Oh, this is great. Oh, we're going to have so much food. We better, oh, it's a full moon. Oh, yeah. How much food does Strongman Bruno need, honestly? 
Like, this is insane. He needs so much food. You know, this is really nice because we can go and venture on during the day and then come back at night, cook food, and then go out and do the same thing over again, which is really great. We're looking for an island with a bunch of trees. Uh, we could have gone to the one we've seen before and actually burnt down a bunch of trees. But I felt like we needed to go somewhere else. Somewhere new. You know what I mean? So we'll go down south uh, next time. Uh, day 10 tomorrow. We'll go down south. Oh, look at this. We've never been so full. Wolfgang is better. 